happening. Yeah, rain and snow <laughs> is gone, and our outlook for traveling locally over the next seven, six, seven days looks fantastic. Yeah, we're going to see mainly clear skies mixed with a few clouds here and there, but overall, no rain and snow in sight for now. And uh, the only issue today might be gripping the steering wheel a little bit as it turns breezy and actually very gusty by tomorrow morning in some locations as that north wind will be with us. Look at Lake Tahoe, so pretty and pristine this morning with a fresh coating of snow, several inches of snow falling at the highest elevations. Lake level, we didn't get any snow, uh, at least in our view here. And yeah, we wouldn't expect it at 6,000 feet. The system was too warm, but it's chilly now. And anything that was wet last evening is certainly now freezing up. It's 24 degrees at the south shore of Lake Tahoe. Quite cold this morning. We're down to 41 in Sacramento, 43 in Stockton. Good morning, Modesto. We're starting out at 45 degrees. Definitely want some layers this morning. And look at the day ahead at Lake Tahoe. The next 12 hours don't warm all that much. We stay in the 20s and mainly 30s. We might creep up to about 40, 42 at some point, but you can see the trend here really keeps us quite cool throughout the day under those mostly sunny skies. Did pick, did pick up quite a bit of rain on the west slope of the Sierra the past 48 hours. So since Friday, Blue Canyon has seen nearly two inches of rain. Same thing around Arnold, Auburn, Placerville, about a half inch or more in the valley, about a third to four tenths of an inch of rain falling and the Bay Area in the North Bay did quite well with the rain go Friday going into Saturday as well. But that system is now on the move out of here back behind it. The cool air is rushing in and beyond today and tomorrow. The warm up will be felt Tuesday and Wednesday as this high moves in keeps our weather very nice. But in between we've got to deal with some north wind. So let's time it out as we look at late this morning. You'll find the gusts still around 10 15 miles per hour. Really very manageable. We get into the afternoon then you'll find the gusts at or above 20 miles an hour. So it turns breezy through our Sunday afternoon. Now in the overnight, the wind will really concentrate on the west side of the valley. So notice a place like Fairfield at about five, six o'clock tomorrow morning. We could see some gusts near 40 miles an hour possibly. But look at a place like Stockton, Modesto, Auburn, Placerville, not seeing a whole lot of wind. And actually this wind is going to back off quite a bit as we go through the day tomorrow. So by Monday afternoon and evening, the wind is quite light and it's going to set the stage for a couple of really pretty days around here Tuesday and Wednesday with just a few clouds in the mix and light winds. Pollock Pines will see a high of around 48 degrees after this very chilly morning. Truckee only near 40 this afternoon. A little bit breezy through Jackson and Grass Valley. Highs will be in the low to mid 50s today in the foothills. In the Bay Area, as Leticia showed us earlier, it's crystal clear this morning. Expecting a lot of sunshine in the Bay Area. Fairfield going to 64. Get ready for that wind coming in, especially tonight. Temperatures in the San Joaquin Valley, about 60 in Modesto, 62 in Manteca. Breezy this afternoon. And you'll find it breezy in Woodland and Elk Grove this afternoon. 63 in Vacaville today, 61 in Woodland. Looking at the seven day forecast, we bump up those temperatures, especially by Tuesday and Wednesday in the upper 60s, partly cloudy skies. Thanksgiving still looks fantastic. We'll call it mostly sunny and 66 degrees. And then we're in the lower 60s later on this week, just to chill in the air. So overall looking great this week for travel locally. We get a little break from mm -hmm. the rain. All right. Thank you, Eileen. Up next, a big.